All righty, welcome to episode 56 of the Consistent Genius Podcast. The fucking patent. <laughs> Five dollars every time someone uses that. Swear You'd jar. be amazed Swear how many jar. people. How many, how, many, how many people use it, though? So many. Exactly. So I got to start charging a fucking royalty fee. You know what I mean? You it's should. ridiculous. And people don't even do it right. They're doing a half one, like the circles. No. Whatever. Remember, you used to do that. You. <laughs> 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 or the snake back in the day at Stubler, I used to get. <laughs> see what I mean? I got him real quick. You know what I mean? Right there. <laughs> people, people at Stubler don't know what that means. You know what I mean? You get. <laughs> <laughs> you know I mean, great. you can touch the finger from the back row. <laughs> <laughs> that figure's eight foot long. <laughs> that almost went popping through my nose. Seriously, hey, you, you were just I just, yeah, I just went to. I went Let to. Let me just do this. I went to McDonald's. <laughs> McDonald's. McDowell's. Anyways, I go to McDonald's and uh, <clears throat> I go there and I go order a McChicken and a, and a Sprite with no ice. I specifically want the drink, but I don't want to be that guy. Hey, just need a dollar drink. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, that's guy. him. Yo, oh, he <laughs> of course. You know what I mean? <laughs> I, John, I know Johnny I Wheel and Deal. That's what he tries to do. You know what I mean? <laughs> but um, so I go there and I get the uh, the dollar drink. They charge me one one away. I don't give a shit. But anyways, I'm rolling through. I'm like, hey, Sprite, no ice. No Key, ice. You know what I mean? Because it's already going to be cold. There's no reason yeah. I'm going to. You, you're going to Sprite with ice? They put the glacier that sank the Titanic in your cup, <laughs> and then they fill up with like one Dixie cup full of Sprite. You get no drink. Zero. That's you know true. I mean? It's gone in one second. That's true. Huh? I really find it hard to believe you got one sandwich, though. Yeah, because we're going to eat. After. Oh, yeah, we are. Oh, that was a clown. That was on the way here. That sandwich. was the appetizer. That was just to keep me going. You know what I mean? Oh, Gotta shocker. Keep, you know what I mean? Shocker. But anyway, so I go there. The guy hands me the small bag, you know, because when you get the one sandwich, you get the smallest bag in the world. Why even waste a bag? Just hand it to me out the window. <laughs> True. Right? What's with the thing they put the fries in, too? I don't get fries. What do you mean? The thing they put oh, the, the fries carton. in. Oh, the carton. Why don't they put it in the same box that the Big Mac comes in? Just put it in the bag. There's really no reason to waste a, a, a little container. But why we, do they put it in the bag? We why? recently started doing that at the chop shop to conserve bags. Yep. <laughs> oh, just, you, know. you should have hey. seen how it was implemented. <laughs> put it in one fucking bag. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, McDonald's here. Super tight. You know what I mean? Hey, we can't be wasting. <laughs> hey, you're wasting 15 tiles on that guy. You know what I mean? <laughs> you get it? Oh, I got it. Yeah, but uh, anyways. My hat. I need my hat. So anyways, this cat, he, he, he gives me the, the smallest bag in the world with a sandwich. And I'm like. My hand's covering the whole bag. I'm like, <laughs> hey, are you forgetting something, pal? He goes, what do you mean? My fucking pop. That's exactly what I said. <laughs> right behind you. And he don't believe me. He's glared at the screen like this. Uh, science 101. <laughs> social studies. <laughs> He's looking at it like a class list. I'm like, yo, the Sprite. No ice, Bill. Yeah, right there, bro. Hit that. Yeah. Put the put the cap on it. Let's go, man. I got I got places to be. People to see. Yeah, seriously. You know what I mean? But they were causing me a Did headache. Did you really have somewhere to go? Here. I had to be at a certain time, but otherwise, right. the wrath of Billy Siege Senior would have came out. You know what I mean, <laughs> Jamie? Ah, uh, we're not doing this tonight. <laughs> Seriously, guy, we'll, re we'll record tomorrow. Guy calls me at two thirty. I mean, like, I'm, I looked at the phone. I was like, I'm <laughs> you got here at six. I'm sleeping. <laughs> he was like, Hey, because you don't tell me what you want. I'm waiting for you to tell me what you want. You go, Yo. He does do that. Yo is not telling me what you want. Tell me what you want. I mean, you could respond. Don't try. To listen. No, 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 no. I know that plan. That trick that you do. That that's that's a small. Uh, you know, young pups don't understand that. Listen, I got the brain of a Navy SEAL. You know what I mean? <laughs> so what happens oh, is really. So what, ha so what happens is when you go yo, if you don't tell me what you want, that yo is just gonna be yo yo all day every day. You know what I mean? Tell me what you want. What you really really want? What How you about want? when you say I'm on two seventy? <laughs> I had to take pictures today to show you to give you the evidence. We really like the picture updates. You, you by weren't the way. even close to 270. You said I'm leaving now. I didn't say I was on 270. Yo, you said I said I'm leaving now, and you said Billy's sitting there. He just wrote ha 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 laughing, <laughs> and I said me too. <laughs> like I wasn't leaving right now. Right. 50 minutes later, you were in front of. Uh, it took an hour to get here, no matter what, man. Oh, the bar. Um, you got to go to Backway, man. Where? If you go down like cross over 270 and turn right. You go down that back road, it comes all the way up to... Do you know what roads are close in Worthington? Have you been been there? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was there a little bit earlier. No. <laughs> what, what, have I been mean, there? Huntley's <laughs> close. It's completely big. Huntley. Huntley. That's over by the train tracks. Yeah. Yeah, no. So you can't go that way. Oh. Uh, you you can't uh, even go, like, by Wilson Bridge Road. It's like the... <laughs> 
<laughs> Five, Bottleneck. It's Metallica and Motley Crue, year one, and they're running a concert right there. You yeah. know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> That's how many people are coming in and out of that joint. It's gotcha. ridiculous, man. You can't go that way. It's sick. Gotcha. The traffic in Columbus is driving me insane. It is horrendous. High Street also. Oh. I used to have a little plan. So at Huntley, there used to be a little cut through from the business standpoint. You could go through. Yeah. They shut that down. Yep. Put cones up, everything. <laughs> I went through one day and it was like, nope, no dice. I couldn't go through. You know what I mean? So I was trying to go through to get back on the backside of Huntley so I can get on like uh, Schrock Road. Oh, Schrock. They got the, uh, the drive through. That's where all the underage kids get their alcohol. <laughs> really? Yeah. What's it called? Schrock, like. Uh, <clears throat> You know, like that place you drive in, and they have all the like the Schrock and Carl right there? drive through. Yeah, it's no Schrock. Yeah, Schrock and Carl it's, right it's there. Schrock Road. There's something. a Dairy Queen right there. Maybe it, that's where the bridge where you lost your tire or whatever you said. <laughs> that was a while, but, a while ago. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's a Sunoco. My cocoa. It's my so funny. Coffee or cocoa is your loco cash or credit for it. Let it at Sunoco. Anyways, go ahead. <laughs> it's so funny how kids will come from all over to go to that one place. Like back in the day, Prologos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right yeah now, can, exactly. You go to Prologos, you go to the drive thru, you used to get like, you know, Honey and Mad Dog 2020. What's that? Oh, <laughs> my God. What's that? I'm so glad you don't even know about that because you shouldn't. Is that like four Any logos? human being. That took five years off my life. Really? You know what I mean? When you drink that stuff. I mean, it is What's like the, wine? the Wasn't worst. Wasn't there a wine, too? Some wine? Wild Irish Red Rose? Yeah. Oh, my <laughs> God. That was like old school, though. You know what I mean? I don't old know school, hardcore, hard, hardcore winos drank that. That's like uh, the girls nowadays like boxed wine. They drink it out of the box. They'll hold it up real high. You know? <laughs> Shit, everybody does. You go to Kroger's? You're I to see that and everybody's glass. flipping. Uh, are they idiots? You're supposed yeah, to they put are. Glass. They, they are. Glass, <laughs> clown. I, but it's funny because I see... Um, Everybody's got that, you know what I mean, constantly. So. They sell it in, like, GFS and stuff. No, they sell it at Kroger's. <laughs> you know well, they mean? probably sell it at both places, both establishments. Bigger GFS? Box, bigger GFS box. is, like, for... Uh, Dude, GFS is great. Yeah, if you have, like, a a company that you're, you know, you're a <laughs> food vendor. You just say Morales' company every time. Yeah, see, that's what I mean. So <laughs> yeah. it's more of a food vendor. But, yeah. yeah. You don't like, I'll say, I just go in and Yeah, you don't have to have it, but they give you, like, points or something. You get, like, no tax or taxes up. No, um, no. I, I don't know if they could do that, technically. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you a little secret. I go to, I go get all my landscaping stuff. It's a, I get all tax exempt. No way. I've never paid tax in my life. How? <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I can tell you. Navy SEAL. <laughs> Navy SEAL brain over here. <laughs> no, all the no you set up an account where it's a tax exempt account. We're at Lowe's? Like Oakland Nursery. Never heard of it. It's a flower store. <laughs> what kind of flowers you buy? Oh, plants, for box woods, uh, stuff like that. You know okay. what I mean? Like to set up, you know, like uh, entrances to homes and stuff yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah. So hey, like what episode we on? 56. 56, all right. Who is that? Lars Taylor. Lars Taylor. Lawrence Taylor. Oh, wait. I don't know who that is. What about the other dude? LeVar Arrington? Thomas. What the, Buckeye the was 56? Bus driver, number, number one bus driver? <laughs> 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 he said number one bus driver. <laughs> bus 56, Tuttle McGree. <laughs> who was 56? No, for the Chiefs. Thomas was Hill. his last name. That's all I know. Derek Thomas. Derek Thomas. He's he the number one sack leader ever. I think he did, didn't he? Yeah, I think he died. LT was a crackhead, wasn't he? I mean, I don't know about all that. Yeah. John Cole. He may have tried smoking crack once or twice. You know, does that make you a, you know. Well, actually, he was he was a big cokehead, I think. Rehab all the time. I could be Dude, kidding. let me tell you a little something about the NFL. In case you didn't realize. <laughs> let me hear it. You know what I mean? But tell him a little something. So the NFL drug testing policy, do you know about that? No. They have it in April. <clears throat> Once you pass that, it's game on. <laughs> you could do whatever you want anytime you want. Yeah. You never have to get tested again outside of getting busted for a DUI or any type of drug or alcohol incident. Right. You do that, you're free. I mean, you could, there's guys that say that they get high every, every time before a game. Oh, I believe it. They admit that. So, is that really a... Oh, that's like Pat McAfee. Didn't he say he used exactly. to smoke weed? He was the kicker, wasn't he? <laughs> you know what I mean? So, but, you know what I mean? The punter. But, the like, punter, that's, yeah. that's where I, I got that info Info was at because of what he yeah. said. He goes, there's it's no holds bar. But then he got in that alcohol incident, and it was like eight times a month you get randomly drug tests. Yeah. I mean, you'll be at the mall, and someone just said, <laughs> drug test. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Pee in a cup. I swear to God, that's how they get you. Yeah, I mean, I can see you holding that cup, <laughs> <laughs> dude. It's so funny when when we did the NCA testing. It's ridiculous how they make you. So you go into this room and there's this guy sitting at like a little elementary desk, and he's sitting right there in your urinal, urinal, 
He makes you strip butt naked. You stand up. You put your hands in the air, and you do a complete 360 spin. <laughs> Swear to God. That's a little weird. No, that's because that's what they they making sure you're not having anything hidden, you know what I mean, on your leg or anything. You know what I mean? When you're doing it for the NCAA, they're doing it pretty, you know, pretty tough. Now, when they do it for the school, just, hey, the school can't afford stuff like that. So they'll just be like... You know, I remember Dan Watham used to come in and we'd do the Dan eye test. Dan Watham. Mm-hmm. You know I mean, just to see if your eyes were jumping. Yeah. Well, you had a rough night of drinking. Your eyes are jumping. Left their, <laughs> they're hey, jumping out the gym like, like you know, Vince Carter. <laughs> yeah. Boom. My eyes are popping. You know what I mean? Yeah. But I guess when you, smoke, when, you smoke, when you smoke a lot of marijuana. <laughs> there we go. Interrupted. But when you smoke a lot of marijuana, I guess it, it jumps. Your eyes jump and so, whatnot. But. I mean, it's just real easy. Just don't mess around with that when you're playing sports. Yeah, I don't exactly. Order, I, don't why, I mean, why would you if you have game or whatever? I don't understand how people, you know, I, just I guess that just shows you people can't get off the weed. Yeah. You know what I mean? Type of thing like that. But for the most part. People love the ganja. It was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, have you been to the new uh, Yogi's on Henderson? I have not, actually. I want to go check it out. Dude, I heard it's, it's off sweet. the hook, man. So I, I, I'll say this. It was Average Joe's, and it was like the fucking parking lot was like you know anytime you want free parking just go over there <laughs> sunday football yeah. you know what i mean me and, me and your dad went over there fucking sunday it was ridiculous i thought it was an insurance convention and they were handing out free hundreds you know I, mean? <laughs> I was like what the hell's going on over here i said bill there's no parking spot he's like hey park down there behind the bushes <laughs> <laughs> it's like what are you talking about and of course he's front row yeah car high, every- right <laughs> uh, underneath the lights nobody's being able to touch his vehicle <laughs> yeah he had a guy out there shining it waxing it buffing the wheels stuff like that i was like fucking guy he wants me to park in the bushes <laughs> You know what I mean? That so, is Bill C-1201. <laughs> oh, VIP parking front row. Hey, and yeah. it was backed in. It was backed in, and I had like three rollers that were there shining. You know, wax on, wax off. They were doing the things, <laughs> making it all shiny like the arm. Mr. Seach, hey, is the armor all good? <laughs> he was asking about the tires and stuff. out there. <laughs> Bill, hey, Bill, he, threw, he just threw a bunch of change on the, on the ground. Here you go, guys. Go get it. And it was like fucking a bunch of pelicans running around trying to grab the food and stuff like that. It was nutty. Clowns. <laughs> so we're, we're in Yogi's, and we're going to order some food, right? First of all, <clears throat> for you guys that haven't ever been there, the lineup's pretty sweet. Just <laughs> heads up from the male perspective. I'm just, you know, let me <laughs> what throw, does that mean, Paul? Let me throw that That's out there. Well, I mean, you know, you got to... I will say there's this old man there. We we named him Mr. Groper. <laughs> Much like Mr. Roper. Oh, dude, he's oh, Mr. Groper. Like he takes these female waitresses and grabs them and pushes them. T- I mean, he literally assaults them. What a beast. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad way to think. No, he's, you know, Mr. Pervert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's no. pr- probably like 65 years I old. I care dude. zero. Yeah, you can't shame. be putting your hands on fucking females like right. that. Yeah, you can't. So the girl's like standing there talking to him, and you, we could tell that she's like leaning back. because Dude, this one chick, I mean, yeah, she he went to grab her ass, and she fucking instantly had the hand ready to fuck, get away. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, touche. Bam. Smacked it off. You know what I mean? Yeah, they get the Detroit lean against them. Or dude, I mean, him. he like brings them in. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, you know I mean, like if I haven't seen some keg, let's go get it in. I need it. I need a good hug. Let's go, man. You know what I mean, he. That, that's what this cat was doing with everybody. I swear to God, I wanted to go over and smell his finger. Jesus, jeez, I know it's terrible, right? That's wonderful. So you guys sit down. What do you get? This cat comes over. You know, I'm, I'm sitting there. I'm occupied by this guy, and I'm like, you know, every every. I'm telling the girls like, don't go over there. Coke throwing breath mints at him. Don't go over there. Yeah. I, I did. I had the things. I was like, hey, you need some of these. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, so we get there, and we're like, no, I never, I've never been there on a Sunday. Yeah. And of course, the veteran over here, he, he hands me the, the what's it called, the game day menu. Game day menu. Game day menu. Or whatever. It's. Like, I, know, I got that pulled up right now. Ten wings, ten, <laughs> ten wings, ten bucks. So I get the mild wings, and so I, you know, because I'm not, you know, I'm not fancy. I like vanilla ice cream. Yeah, you know I mean, interesting. Just that's it. You know, if I go to the ice cream store, it's vanilla. I don't need Rocky Road with pecan nuts and stuff like that. I get cotton candy bubble gum. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> you and my old roommate, Mike Freck. He would come over. Oh, let's get the chunky monkey. I'm like, bro, let's just get fucking vanilla. And call it a day. You know what I mean? We're yeah. still getting a little taste. 
We're getting the ice cream feel. We're getting that creamy feeling going down. You know, the sensation to hit your cold, your chest. You know, when you hit that, like, <sighs> you know, the ice cream yeah, goes yeah. down. Your chest, it's great. Had some ice cream last night. Great beautiful. feeling. Oh man, I might have to stop a UDF and get like a malted milkshake later too. You should. <laughs> Tremendous. In case anybody has never been there either. Anyways. So we come and we order. What's the girl's name? It's so funny because Bill will be like, hey, what's your name? And then she'll walk away. I'll be like, what's her name? <laughs> oh, I don't know. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately. I'm Every not time. Dude. Every time. It's like, what's her name? I don't know. I forgot. <laughs> it's like Casey Anthony. <laughs> it's like, no, not her. <laughs> Susie. <laughs> Susie. <laughs> Mary. Phil, Phil. <laughs> Mary. Mary, mother, Susie, whatever. You know, we just start calling them names and stuff. Yo, yo, yo. Come here. Right over here. <laughs> so it's funny because I forgot that. But she forgot what we ordered. Yeah, so we go like this. I said, you know, I ordered 10 mild. He, What do you order? 10 garlic? Yeah. Yeah. Spicy garlic. So she comes over to recheck the order. And she goes, what did you get again? Uh, you got uh, 10 hot Asian? <laughs> <laughs> and I look at her. I'm like, 10 hot Asian? But I lost it. <laughs> yeah, see, he just loses it. He goes, Asian? Oh, that shit's racial. That's racial. <laughs> <laughs> that's a that's a. Ra-. And I'm like... I guess I'm the hot Asian. <laughs> so all the the rest of the time, she started calling me the hot Asian. It the hot like, Asian. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? I said, hey, mild. For Christ's sake. So don't forget my fucking blue cheese either. <laughs> you know what I mean? So right there, you know, I mean, uh, now my weight experience is already starting to go downhill. Plus, I got to look at Mr. Groper to my left. You know what I mean? Mr. <laughs> yeah. Groper was there, man. It was ridiculous. Then later on throughout the uh, evening, <clears throat> and the place is packed. It always point, is. To the point packed. where, like, you go to the 1 o'clock games, and then there will be some people that leave. And then there will be a couple tables that open up. But, you know, then, of course, the gambling degenerates that we are, we sit and we get to see both games or whatnot. You know what I mean? Yeah. So we're watching, <laughs> so we're watching both games. Do you forget? <laughs> Jamie, he already put the corner. Incognito no more. You know what I mean? <laughs> Incognito so, no more. So those faces you make, they're still going to be prevalent to the audience, okay? And he said, oh, now you messed now everything you up. Yeah, we're fine. Why did you even do that? I, everything he, was fine. He was over to the left too far. No, because that's because he's moving. moving. Yeah. He's oh, over he there. He's moving. Hey, like make that. a move. Cow Town, <laughs> USA over here. But anyways. Uh, you forget. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, so uh, that's, a, that's a saying. You ever heard of that? Anyways. So, we're sitting there to four o'clock games, and we see these two chicks come in. And uh, that's girls for anyone who doesn't know the terminology. Was that? A, I didn't say broads. I know, but young people don't call them chicks. And they much. weren't even that like. Hot what do you mean? Thing? Young people don't call them chicks. Like lots what do you of call people. Them? What do you call? Them? Bitches or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> that's terrible. <laughs> he whispered it. <laughs> <laughs> bitches, bitches. That's terrible. No, yeah, I, people, I heard some of your previous podcasts. I mean, that's you're so you got to get a whooping every time you say that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Seriously, well, you're bringing a bad name to like you know you know, you know that's degrading. Yeah, no, they're queens. You know I mean? All women are queens. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Now you're now you're being facetious. You know? Do you know what that word means? Yeah, I do. Anyways, uh, no, but so a couple of chicks come in and are you know decent looking. They're walking around and they're playing like fucking musical chairs. They sit down at one place. They hate the they hate the where they're sitting at. They're almost, they're almost outside. And then they walk over here. They they're looking at the bar and stuff like that. And your dad looks at me and goes, "Hey, have them sit with us because <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna leave." Yeah, and we were getting ready to cash we're out. We're getting ready to cash out, so we can sit here or whatnot. Just tell them to come here and sit down, and then you know we can have a little mild conversation or whatnot. You know? Yeah. So I don't think I said that. <laughs> that's what you were thinking. But that's what you were thinking. So anyways, I'm like, yo, I thought a little <laughs> and I got nothing. <laughs> she looked at me and says, I don't know about that move. No shot. Am I coming over to you? No way. So, no, but I mean, the hot no Asian way. was yelling at him. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she was like, yo, hot Asian, don't be doing those moves like that. But uh so your dad gets up and he goes, Hey, you know, he gives her <laughs> and all of a sudden the one girl goes, Really? You know what I mean? So, boom, she, they come over, they sit down. <clears throat> I mean, long story short, we try to make conversation, and, you know, basically we were getting the, you know, for, for as nice as us to reach out to somebody like that, you would think that they'd be interactive. Yeah. You know, they weren't. Well, they were the one was. The other one was like, <laughs> yeah, who are on, you? On the phone. Oh, Bill Seats, Bill Seats Jr. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm, playing, I'm playing Tetris. <laughs> yeah, I mean, or whatever you guys do on your phone 24-7. Oh, but, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was uh, it, it was interesting to say the least. So I mean, we even introduced, we tried to bring them down to the little bar, really for the game. We we're like, hey, come, come down to the yeah. game. 
You know what I mean? Come to he was like, come to Red Bull One. You'll see. <laughs> You'll see the best bar back in town. Yeah, yeah. Yes, sir, baby. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if he ain't next door watching TV. <laughs> his feet up. His feet will be up. His Cigar. hands will be in the back. Hey. Going, hey, Todd, <laughs> give him a burger, man. Where the fuck's that burger at? Yeah. Sipping some cider. Oh, my God. I want to talk about that chop shop experience again still. <laughs> Wait, I just want to say, flag, you mean flag. You, you I mean. still want to talk about it. It's so interesting to me that I came in. They gave Bo, the guy who has a limp and a, you know what I mean? His glasses are on crooked. I mean, he, they gave him his sandwich before me. <laughs> hey, Paul's fucking sandwich is over here. That's what I get. <laughs> just like my ass with it. Come get it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you know I mean, and I still ate it. It was tremendous. Yeah. What happened to Roller at Chop Shop? Okay, so. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hey, you're this not is, done. You're not done. This is definitely, this is part. Yeah, yeah, I'm done. This is part of the. Uh, you forgot the part when we left Yogi's. We wanted to slice the girl's tires because we were like, <laughs> that's that fucking up. bitch was rude. <laughs> I didn't say that. We didn't want to, but you know. <laughs> no, that's what I thought. <laughs> hey, we don't like downtown. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we don't like downtown. Right. Those, are the, those aren't the droids you're looking for. Oh, we're like, those. They were rude as hell. I, I mean, agree. I agree. Yeah. I mean, they were rude, but you know what I mean? The they one just, was. They were just off-putting. Jamie Is that what was it means? pissed. No. I mean, no. They weren't being interactive they as, weren't as much hot, as... To be honest with you. Uh, yeah, they, they weren't. wasn't trying to like hit... Yeah. I wasn't trying to hit them at all. They weren't that, you know... Yeah, we paid our tab. We were leaving anyways. I was just trying to be nice. They oh. weren't that smoking. Because Alex was working, too, who's a friend of ours. Did they bring over the A-team, Gina? No. Mm. Alex there, is easy. No, 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 no. The no, other no. two girls were brilliant. There was some, de- there was some <laughs> definitely, you know, formidable opponents yeah. on that side. <laughs> Trust me. That's why I said, hey, if you've been to Yogi's on Henderson, I definitely recommend you going. I was about to stop in. I was driving home from the chop shop, and uh, yeah, that's he, why. I here's why I like Yogi's on Henderson because it's closer to my house than oh, I'm driving. Oh yeah. So I'm like, I can do that. It's like boom. You know what I mean? Sh- one or two exits. You just shoot right down there. 315, yep, yep. right? Yeah. About right halfway there. there, right? Yep. Yeah. Man, we might need to hit Yogi's. All right, go back to the roller thing. So, we'll this is different thing. than the, uh, than I lost my phone, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's a part of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like part two. <laughs> I love it. Was it so carryover? So, Twin try carryover. So, you didn't get the information until this week or what? No, yeah. So, well, first of all, when you said come see the best bar back in town at Rebel <laughs> One, you mean. <laughs> Don't see him because I'll be at the chop shop. So I was at the chop <laughs> shop Thursday. You know, I come in and uh, EJ, my buddy, uh, he works at Big Bar Security. Yeah, yeah. He's like, yeah, man, I got a story for you. The other day, this hobbit came in. <laughs> so, and I'm like, okay, go on. <laughs> that's fucked up. This <laughs> that's hobbit. What, you know, and then he's like, yeah, he just like walked in. You know, the Christopher Montesante, you know, the power walk. Where you're, you're, you're mean business. He walks right in, right around like everything, and right to the back. And EJ and one of the supervisors like watches this happen, and they're like, who is this guy? Why is he going in the back? He had the Montesanti walk. That's why yeah. they didn't they didn't want to question him. It was like that. Hey, I know what I'm doing. Give me my fucking phone. Yeah. Cole, where's my fucking phone? <laughs> Flag. Where's my fuck that's the funniest of all time. I'm gonna get that shirt, Cole. Where's my fucking phone? <laughs> scooter. Hey Scooter, uh, what's going on? Do you so, look back here? So I guess the uh, the girlfriend posts up up by the front bar. Oh my god! She's, you know, by the cashier. Shh. Roller sales went down billions at that point in time. <laughs> was this the same day? No, this was the next day, Sunday. Oh, okay. Or wait, no. I don't know when it was. It must have been early. Maybe it was like a weekday, like a Monday or something. Because I wasn't there. Maybe it was yeah. Sunday night when I left. But the girlfriend posts up. You know, she's watching the front, make sure no one comes after Roller. I guess. Uh, both the guys in the kitchen. Is this Bonnie and Clyde? <laughs> yeah, I guess. They run out the back. They, you know, one stays by, like, the kitchen to make sure no one comes in, and the other guy runs downstairs to apprehend Roller. Apprehend and, the uh, hobbit. <laughs> 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 they brought the lasso. Oh. <laughs> they lasso That's him. what they call the onion ring. They go, uh, one lasso. You know, they got Roller with the onion ring. Oh, my God, so, dude. So he was down there looking for his phone? Yeah, I guess he tells one of them, like, Cole found my phone and put it down here. So he was, like, looking around. He was going to try to get in the office or something. I don't know how that was going to happen. But Did he find it? I don't know. It didn't get that far. <laughs> so <laughs> we'll find out Saturday. I can't wait to ask him no more. <laughs> oh if he's God. got that phone off, you better yell at him. <laughs> he ain't got the phone. He's, You know, he did have a phone, though, because he was talking to somebody. I don't he know who. He has a phone. Oh, when? Oh, Yesterday or whatnot. Yeah, so he has some sort of phone. I see him on Facebook. He's back on Facebook uh, liking up a storm or whatever. He shares some good stuff, some fun things, I will say. <laughs> You're right. I have a good time looking at it. The Obama phone he has. <laughs> Free phone. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, you see Jamie. He's moving. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, let's go. This guy, you're done over here, Josh. Oh, I don't know. You can see that. Yeah, we oh, can see, we, get you yeah, we can see everything you're doing. That's Seriously. why it's great. So we have two laptops. That's why you're there. supposed to be looking up stuff for us, but you don't. You're like, oh, yeah. let me interrupt this guy like, in this yeah, conversation. If you, like, if you like a topic, you just post it right there. We'll we have like, some topics. We do have some topics. Yeah. Let's talk about the frustration and agony that my son was in this morning. Bill's my son, in case no one knew. But <laughs> hey, Epi- what episode? Is hey, fifty six guys. Hey, you're just finding this out right hey, now. Dummy, hey, dummy, you. listen. <laughs> he locked himself out of his phone. <laughs> the most miserable kid in the world for six hours. So like, I woke up all groggy <laughs> about eight a.m. You know, I like going to type in my phone. No, it boom, wasn't eight a.m. By ten a.m. No, it was. It was eleven thirty. So no, I had class at ten thirty. <laughs> had to leave at ten nine fifty. So Did you I sent me up. a post that said, "Oh, was that the other day?" It might have been the other day. It might have been Monday. Oh, okay. Monday, I, I sleep in. So I, you know, boom, 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 lock. So it locks for a minute at first. You know, that's how it works. And then boom, 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 put iPhone. it again, again. Welcome yeah. to iPhone. So you put in the wrong one Junk. again. It's Five minutes. I'm like, damn. Go to get a shower. Come back. Boom, boom, boom. Hour. Fifteen minutes. No. <laughs> so if you get the wrong code, you, the wrong code. That's how many. It's time supposed it? to be face face recognition. For some reason, the reboot made it go to the. So like, okay. So right code. now, if I do and this, you don't know the passcode. So it's locked, but it'll unlock. So like, you just look at it. If you try to unlock it without my face, it'll say you know face ID. But if I look at it, it unlocks. Now, once you restart the phone, you have to type in the actual code. Last night, it reset. Therefore, I had to type in the code in the morning. For some reason, I couldn't remember the code. <laughs> the code. The code. How do you not know the code? Because it's like muscle memory, and you just, after a while, you forget it. You know, and I was, I got a lot of codes on my mind, you know, as you know. <laughs> I know a lot of, you know. <laughs> no. A lot of well, numbers. That go just make the it brain. your ATM code for crying out, Pete. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know I mean? That's I mean, the I reason could, why you were locked I out of your phone for two hours. <laughs> I could have, but hey, long story short, the frustration of not having a phone for his age kid for how long? Probably like eight hours. Eight hours. Get the hell out, really? Yeah. yeah. I drove to school, drove back, went to lunch without a phone. Yeah. He's like, call Paul. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, call Paul. <laughs> call everybody. Was that? Oh, this was at two o'clock. Yeah. Yeah. The yo. That's where the yo. You came still in. didn't have a phone at two? No. Cut your wrist. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, dude. No so, phone yeah. without. Oh it was God. agony. So I had to reset it. Lost a bunch of my pictures. Rest I got a do- I got. What do you mean you lost so. your pictures? What do you? What do I mean? What do you mean? Back I up. lost my pictures. It's backed up, isn't no, it? No, it's not backed up. You don't have them backed up? No. Why not? Never did it. Dude, did you lose them all? Yeah. That's so stupid. I told you, let's go to the store. <laughs> uh oh, Papa Bear's coming out. Jamie's Papa, pissed. don't preach. That's so stupid. I'm hit trouble the deep. Yeah, they no. can re- they can pull the card and put it in something. No. What do you know? It's false. false. Jamie, if it was that simple, then how would people not steal more phones? Because you got to prove who you are. Can't do that. You have to put your code in. So, like, what happens is, I don't know what, trust me, I found an iPhone 7. Guess what? It's a paperweight. Do you, you have it? We can fix that. What's that? We can get in there. Oh. We'll talk about that later. Yeah, but I got in there. It's just you can't activate it. We have to reset it. I reset it. Did you really? Yeah. Huh. We'll check it out. You and me. Yeah. <sighs> Crimination is over souls. I mean, do that. What are you talking about? Yeah. What are you talking What's about? What's statute limitations? Penn State next week, baby. The Little Bar Saturday. Come and see Paul Coates. Come and stop. Hey, are we getting a tent? Are we getting a tent? Fuck no, we're not getting a tent. <laughs> 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 do you know how? Never mind. I'm not even going <laughs> to. We're not getting a tent? <laughs> no. Do, uh, go ahead. Finish Mark, that statement. Do you know how what? Expensive that? <laughs> no, you got to jump through hoops, from what I understand. And yeah, because you need construction guys to go out and know how to fix it. And that's the problem is he doesn't have any construction guys anymore. So Pat Buttress used to be his construction guy, would go ahead and drill holes into the ground so he can place those poles in there. He doesn't have that anymore. <clears throat> and then I don't think that they fixed the uh, the holes last year. They were supposed to put quick quickcrete. Dan in was holes. in charge of that. <laughs> yes, did Dan fix that? <laughs> I don't know. No, I don't think he did. You know what I mean? So Dan was like, oh, I'll get that. Yeah, right. So, But then he can't wait to come and plow a lot. I, yeah, I don't think, we, uh, I don't think we're going to have a tent. If we do, it'll be cool. But otherwise, it'll, be, it'll still be sweet. We'll be out there. It's supposed, to be, like it's supposed to be nice. 45 and sunny. Yeah, it'll be a nice day. 45 I, and sunny? I, I snow. Snow? Jamie, Google that Where shit. Where are you at, Canada? 
dude hurts dude, snow. Jamie does no <coughs> research around You have here. no dude. clue about weather whatsoever. Dude, you I'm get up like, hey, it's raining. <laughs> <laughs> here we go. Oh, that ain't That's a Hilliard clown. Well, yeah. How's that any different? What are you talking about? It's a new god. Hey, how's Dayton any different than Columbus? Oh, no, it it's changed. It's a half hour difference in weather. Oh, no. What? This ain't good. 50% chance at 1 o'clock. You know, that might not be uh, the best. That we're, Hey, man, that hey, ain't right. Hey, what about the... Weren't you supposed to tell us something about a hospital? Oh, wait, yeah. What What were you doing at the hospital? What were you doing at the hospital? Oh, you looked at that? Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Uh... Man, uh, first of all, the Ohio, walk is ridiculous. Ohio I know. State Hospital is like the biggest hospital. It's Cedar Point indoors. <laughs> <laughs> like, if anyone's ever been to Cedar Point, you go from roller coaster to roller. The reason I choose to to go to like every roller coaster once I get there, I'll jump on the Demon Drop, and then go to the next one, and then the next one, and is because I don't want to walk. The walk is obscene. Yeah, well, I walk one way and then come back the other way. You're right. But uh, anyways, last night, so. Hold on, ten day. Here we go with the ten day. Uh, Here we go. It's like the news. It says channel. Fridays rain forty percent. What about Saturday? Uh oh. Fifty. <laughs> That's not good. We'll Dude, figure 58, it out. Fifty eight we'll rain. Out. Trust me, we'll fifty eight rain ever. I get fifty it's seventy percent chance of rain when I'm working, never rains. <laughs> never rains. Yeah. Like, hey, keep working, buddy. <laughs> Keep going me. strong. You know what I mean? I'm like, you motherfucker. <laughs> and you want to use my language. But yes. So, anyways, um, Jamie just deleted every topic. <laughs> somebody that uh, a friend of mine, a friend of mine has a friend, and uh, sh- they didn't pay the gas bill. At the hospital? <laughs> no, 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 a friend of mine has a friend. Okay. A friend Listen, follow a, the story, Jesus. The female. Okay. Right. A friend of mine has a has friend. A friend. They didn't pay the gas bill. Okay. We there? That has nothing to do with it at the hospital. It's not a riddle. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so a friend of mine has a friend. Yeah. They didn't pay the gas bill. Okay. When you don't pay the gas bill and you have to shower, you don't want to take cold showers. Right. You know what I mean? You right. want to take warm showers or hot showers or hot, hot baths, which yeah. you, no way am I taking a bath. But <laughs> you stuck. Women. <laughs> well, I keep forgetting they got tubs that will fit you. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, they got a spa that will fit you. Anyways, uh, so she's taking a bath. Yeah. So what does she do? Boils the water. Why? Because she wants it hot. Why do you boil the water? Do you know the temperature <laughs> with boiling water? 360. I'm going to kill you. 100, 212. 212, right? exactly. 212. This is the education hey, you're knows. paying for? <laughs> no, it's one one Kelvin. 212. It's 212. Yeah. So coffee temperature is right around 190, she put 180. fucking 212 in the tub? Hey. More than 212. I don't even know. Can it be more than 212? Yes. So <laughs> m- my friend my yeah. friend said, hey, she probably fell asleep. And then it was a big Navy bean pots that she was put. The dog tripped her. Fell. Fucking fell into the water. No way. Yeah. Burn unit. Yeah. No I'm doubt. not lying. Hey, so we went there. Fucking skin was hanging off the arms. So mind you... Fucking water splashed at the face. Oh, yeah. Oh my. So imagine, you know, Blister City. Now, I touched the goddamn Husqvarna exhaust once. Boom, touched it for a second. My skin on my hand popped up. It was like I had the gout times 10. <laughs> Melted, yeah. Oh, my God. It was like up to here on a baseball in my hand. <laughs> like the water bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what I was like. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You know what I mean? But here's the thing. So I didn't want to bust it. You bust it and all that skin just like hanging. Yeah. But that's what happened. Hers hit the soft portion portion of your, you know, I mean, look, look how soft the inside of your arm is. Yeah. You know I mean, that's like a sensitive area. Yeah. You get a burn there, skin's going to rip. Yeah. So when the medical people told me what they have to do, I went home. <laughs> Sandpaper, right? Yeah. Yeah. Like a scrub brush. Yeah. And they got to fucking tear all that dead skin off and fucking kill you. Yeah. No and scrub it all off. That's fun. Oh, my God. Like, I went and I was like. In the garden, like I felt like I was like William Dafoe in in the, in the movie Platoon when he got shot and his hands go up like that. <laughs> that was like the pain that I I just felt. You know, it was it hurt me so much my prostate started hurting. I was like, ooh, <laughs> you know. <laughs> I'm serious. The That's thing terrible, about the man. scrub brush. Right? What's up? 
don't know. I mean, we don't know. <laughs> no, she ain't all right. No, That's I mean, no. <laughs> You're in the oh, burn unit at Ohio yeah. State. You know what I mean? Hey, there could be better times. You know what I mean? I don't care if you're in the toilet and you're there for eight hours and you got dysentery. Wow. You're having a better time than being in the burn unit. Seriously. You know what I mean? I mean, yeah. 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 So, anyways, they're scrubbing her down. I'm like, I said, dude, we can't wait for this. Did the dog get hit? <laughs> the dog. Yeah, she don't even know if the dog got burned. I don't even know. <laughs> dog with her. <laughs> 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 Leave me that's outside. a dog was like, hey, that's what you get from putting me outside. Put me outside week. too long. Fuck yeah. you. <laughs> exactly. Let me go ahead and do it. Dude, I would take that dog to the pound. It'd be like seven <laughs> days to get an odor or you're dead, player. You know what I mean? Where you euthanize your ass. I'd take him to Tauti's house. Leave him there. <laughs> <laughs> you guys remember when someone paid like 400 to bury the dog? <laughs> <We're> <laughs> but that's a great story. That brings us back. Reminisce. That Bring that back reminisce. to 42. <laughs> Was that, oh four, my no, God. that was 45 or 46? <coughs> no, so the, the dog tripped my mom coming down the steps at Kristen's house. That's how she broke her hip, dude, a couple years back. That dog? The fu- the Yeah. The no. Greyhound. No. no. No, you remember the Greyhound. <laughs> you remember the crazy dog. That was a... Uh, Fucking Chow Chow. No, 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 no. No, no, different dog. Gemma. It's the Tauties no, it wasn't dog. Gemma. It was the little one. No. The little hunting dog, wasn't it? The one that died. These fucking Gemma. guys. Hey, you got a kettle of dogs over here. How was, many fucking dogs did the Seaches have? My mom was over there in Boston visiting. Oh, okay. And she's coming down the step. The last step, the dog tripped her and she falls on her hip. Well, we're not telling the whole story. She turned around on the last step. She heard a noise. She said, whoo. Oh, so you're blaming me, Ma. Yeah, she's blaming me, Ma. I, I'm not going to say she it. She was laid up for six months. A, she could be kind of a klutz with some things. So, like, you know, I don't know if the dog... So you're saying there should be no, really, there shouldn't be animals at her feet. And you think, guys got cats and stuff like that all over the joint. I don't, think, one cat. That, I don't think the dog's to 100% blame is what I'm trying to say. Okay. Long story short, the dog tripped her. And she fell down. Broken hip, six months in the hospital. It was crazy. Fucking dude, hey, that, that dog would be BB gun material all day. You know what I mean? <laughs> What'd they do? They killed the dog probably, right? No. No. That's trophy dog. They keep that thing. <laughs> they said, we're going hunting this week. Let's go. Oh, why, That dog's a work dog? The yeah. hunting dogs, yeah. Hunting dog. Work dog. When you say the Tauties, you act like they live at like they live at the Duck Dynasty ranch. They do. Dude, well, they, they hunt. The, Jeff hunts the shit out of everything. He, well, he, I agree that. I mean, he lives in Ohio. You go fishing, he comes up with a knife. But the ta- they live in Boston. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, yeah I mean, but dude. They, they, hey, big. There's a lot. That's restaurant row. They had turkeys there. They no, shoot them in the backyard. Dude, Boston's like rural where, where they're at. Oh, so like they give you the same perception of like Ohio. So a lot of people dude, that don't know no. Ohio <laughs> thinks that Ohio is just straight farm town. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, got, yeah. Within like 15 miles of their house, they got one McDonald's. That's it. Here, we got 50 of them. But then you drive to Boston, it's like, burr, 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 yeah, burr, burr, yeah, you can't yeah, move. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, they live about hours. You want to kill everyone. Yeah. That's nutty. So they live in the rural part of yeah, but yeah. The, Boston. Lost, yeah. Like Boston said, is nice but, as hell. But I then like they could drive and they go to the Cape. Yeah. Boom. And they're so there. it's like probably, what, two hours to the Cape? Yeah. So the okay. the drive is pretty killer. Driving so to Boston is killer, too. So they got a whole bunch of different living environments. Oh, yeah, definitely. Very. Uh, Land to sea. <laughs> I, th- I thought they were uh, city, like pe- city folks. No. Suburban. No. No. Well, no. 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 They're they, live by, they actually live by Foxborough, like seven miles from Patriot the Casino. Stadium. Patriot Stadium. Look at me. This I say casino. casino. Yeah, Seriously, yeah, where's seriously. your brain at? <laughs> at the casino. At the casino. Speaking of, we've been to Foxwood. Where's the though? list? He deleted it. <laughs> Are you serious? Gone. Are we're done with the list? No, we're not. What's the next one? Penn State week, man. <laughs> that was the last one. <laughs> Cocus is. Are you serious, <laughs> dude? Shot. No, where's the list? He deleted the whole it's list. It's gone, dude. There was three more. There was not three more. <laughs> fucking put you on a computer, dude. Next week, don't give him that fucking computer. <laughs> Swear to God, dude. Let him not even have a picture. No, you, you guys can do it. You guys can do it by yourself. <laughs> hey, we pulled a good you prank. Yeah. Start without. Hey, hey, just hey, go ahead, America. No, we took the camera off of start incognito out. over here, and so he got all he got all butt hurt and was like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, "You guys can do it by yourself." Mm-hmm. <laughs> And then I pull Let me up. not have a picture and just a voice. I'll be good all day, every day. I ain't got. You know what I mean? <laughs> Listen. Now you want to type Penn State? You misspelled it. 
<laughs> look, I made him look. <laughs> oh, oh my funny. god, this guy's Don Rickles. <laughs> okay, oh we do god. have a topic. This what past works? weekend, there were a few poker games that went down. So I wasn't invited to get to talk. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? He just said, hey, by the way. <laughs> yeah, and then rubbed it in. I thought it was this Friday. He was like, hey, Friday, we got a game. Donnie Dixon's. <laughs> hey, it's, it was a quick, it's a quick, it's a quick game. I was like, okay, well, today's Tuesday. <laughs> he tells me for Friday. That's a pretty good time period as far as like the time I can get to the game. I think I can make a decision by then. <laughs> and then he goes, oh, no, it already happened. <laughs> He didn't know anybody. He goes, hey, you didn't know anybody. You didn't there. know anybody anyways. And I said, well, let me get this straight here because that's the best way you want to. You want to enter a poker game not knowing anybody. <laughs> oh, you didn't know anybody. I would have been the only guy you knew. <laughs> like, that's perfect. Perfect. You know I mean? Perfect. Listen. <laughs> but then again, I can't, you know, no, I can't play. You know what I mean? Hey, Why next can't time. I Why can't I first me? I got to play? play? No. No. No, because then I would have invited Cocos. You know, no, he pony. wouldn't have, folks. Just to let you know, <laughs> these these alleged poker games—I don't even know if they exist. <laughs> you don't know laugh I mean? at him <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! I Eight hours the, without his phone. Doctors and lawyers had a game last night too. Slow down. I thought that was Monday. That is What's today? Monday. Tuesday. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh Island tonight. Losing my days. Let's go new new episode. New episode. That's right. Are they finding stuff? Oh, you cash tree. That's what I told I, one of the players over there at the, at the doctors and lawyer games. I was like, "Yo," he goes, "Come down, man. Get, get get in this game." I was like, "Yo, man, they don't have a cash tree down there." He goes, "Yeah, we got a couple trees." <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, what's that mean? I can come and grab some cash. And then it was crickets after that. <laughs> <laughs> No, but they play all them fucking rinky dick games. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's like, drama. No, they fucking, don't. They don't. They play a round of drama. Omaha. But you know how to play Omaha. I like Omaha. Four card Omaha. Then they play a round of Big O. See, see uh, 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 America. America. Let's look right now. <laughs> America. Is there a Big O? When you go and put card games in Vegas, is Actually, there something called Big O? No. Yes, there is. Explain it. All it is is high low. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> it's, that's, it's not called Big Low, Big O, then. It is called Big O. Why is it called Big O? If it's high low, it is. It's high low. Big Why is it called Big O? It's called Big O because you get five cards, and it's high-low. There's no drawing, no nothing. That's it. You have to have eight low to go low. It, it, so you just get five cards? Yeah. So if you got ace-deuce, and the, the, you have to get five under eight. Right? So there's right? a board. There's a, yeah, just like no, 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 no. There's no Vegas game where you have a board. Coke, you ain't been to Vegas in how long? There's, I don't care. I know all the games. I'm updated on them. There, are you? There, there is no games called Big O, and there's no games where you get five cards and then you have a board. You just explained the game. Not a board. I just want like ex- Texas Holdem is what he's talking about. I want to explain how you explained this. You just said you get five cards and you get whoever's low. I don't think I was finished. I got interrupted. <laughs> no. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> okay. We talk about the interruption thing flag on the play <laughs> okay so uh, so that's the pot so, calling the kettle exactly black man, right so hey man he's got a point here there's both interrupting still so <laughs> the guy that plays in the game with us played big o in vegas so i know and he played in the world series these guys know the poker better than a lot of people we've played with long story short big o is a high low game where you get five cards it's dealt like a hold'em table, right? You have to have eight less to go low. That's it. Poker high. So it's a round of that. Then it's a round of five-card Omaha. And then it's one round of name your game. So every player picks a different game. Yeah, that's what I love about the internet. He loves the internet. I mean, you should be looking it up. That sounds fun. Looking what up? I don't know if Big O is a game of Vegas. Definitely not. 100% <laughs> I think high-low can be... But I don't know if it's played with five cards. High low is usually played with, you know, like Texas Hold'em high low. Yep. Listen, if we only, if only we had a list <laughs> pulled up on the Google Doc. No, we're we're all digital. looking it up right now. How to play Big O Poker? It says it right there on the internet. You can Google Dramaha and it'll tell you how to play Dramaha, but they don't have it in a casino. In Vegas. Dramaha is the best game ever. So created. if Dick, it, okay, so it might be called Raz. No. Raz is a different game. I've played that too. Raz is a form of stud poker. It is normally played for ace to five low. So it's a low game. 
Oh, so that means it's one of the world. oldest forms of poker. It's played since the very start of the 20th century. It's emerged around the time that people started using a 52 deck instead of a 20, 20 for poker. But the reason why I'm saying this, this picture indicates. I can't see it. No. <laughs> That the guy's holding five cards in his hand. So if you say, hey, what's Raz? How's that different from Big O? I didn't hear what you said. I was reading. How is Raz <laughs> different from Big O? I don't know. I don't remember. You just said, you know what? No, I know what Raz is. <clears throat> well, look up Big O. I, I don't need to look up Big O. I need to prove that there is no Big O. <laughs> yeah. Or I don't need to prove that there is a Big O. You need to prove that there is a Big O. I just looked it up and said there is. Where, where do they play that at? Google. Listen, ladies. <laughs> All right. Now Anyways. we got a topic for this. Well, let's come back to that later. Okay. All let's right. revisit at a later date. Big O. So, let's, no, my, my, the topic was you guys play rinky dick games. And you said, no, they play Omaha. <laughs> then they play Big O, which also. is a fucking rinky dick <laughs> game. So, go ahead with the next game. No, that's it. There's four of them. That's it. He said the next game is five card Omaha. Five card Omaha, same which they don't play in they Vegas. Don't play in Vegas. It's a rinky dink game. And then game. name your game, so you already know he's and like. That's a rinky dink he, game. He's like drama. <laughs> now my game on Friday. Every was, that's a rinky dink game. Uh, just fucking put yourself and put a blindfold on and pick a card. Seriously. Hey, if you pick red, you win. That's low red. What I flip. <laughs> low red and what I flip. Flip is wild. Exactly. <laughs> that's great. Friday, all Texas hold them. You know. When tonight? This Friday? No, last Friday. We should get. Game, but <laughs> we'll have to see. We should do it Saturday night. Dude, we have work. We're going to be done. It's noon. Dude, we could do it after that. Can we get some of the guys to play? Oh, they all the clowns play. They're all going to have cash. Oh, roller. Like, what do you mean? Like, any of the guys that are there? The barbacks. Screw that. I mean, just get our own guys. That's like pulling teeth, man. Phil's in retirement. We ain't see, I haven't seen him since last he was He's a the baseball commissioner. <laughs> I love saying that. <laughs> I know he's trying to run a baseball league. No, but, I mean, you know, Donnie he's, Dixon's tied down usually with the wife. He's Lou Diamond Phillips. Who's that? Big O is played at the MGM, sir, so you can all prove yourselves wrong. No, it's not. I just looked it up. <laughs> How come it's not on our screen? Because my screen is not showing the same fucking thing. Oh, 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 oh. You just moved your face. Whatever. No, it's not no. Show- now you're showing your boobs. Bill, why is it showing it? <laughs> I keep forgetting. Give him a bra. Don't get, hey, don't get look, mad. I want you to look. Dude. I have that, and you have that. Because you ruined the yeah, list. It's a little different. No, what did you do to, to the, the list? list? No, it's a different. You have to put it on the list. How do you share it? Just click, copy the link and post it on the list. I'm a sucker. You <laughs> can they see what you're posting? You can't see that. No, huh? no, 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 they should no. be able to see what I can see. Yeah, that'd be sweet. You should be able to, so I can show you. But anyways, it's played at the MGM. I actually oh do have God. some. Listen, we have some. We have Why some would I make it up, dude? No, I, these I, guys are like serious poker players. They're terrible. It could be at the MGM, but I think you are. You're giving a false bravado because people with pot m- limit big O five card Omaha cash game. You do have to understand that people with more. You just money said it was a high low games. game. I just told you that. You said it was high, uh, uh, a low only. No, I didn't. I said pot limit big O, a five-card Omaha. I'm so game. glad that we are on tape because you said a big O. It's a five-card low game, eight low. No, it's high low. No, I, did, I he, didn't say. He said high low. Okay. I said high low. Can't wait to rewind. Rewind. <laughs> rewind hey, wait. that shit. Let's bet. You said it was eight low. <laughs> Let's bet that I didn't say it was eight low. You <clears> have to have eight or better to but go why did low. you just say Omaha? I'm reading what it says. That's they, O, big O? Is Omaha? Potlet is a five-card Omaha cash game, and then it continues on. I can't see the rest of it. So it's not a high-low game. Coke, it's a high-low game. Jesus Christ. Is it that hard to understand? <laughs> Jesus. There's a hey, poker hand. Pump the brakes. There's You're a poker no hand. Set. You're getting upset. I can and see you getting no upset. <laughs> see, I mean, geez, oh, wheeze, because I, mean, I know you didn't say hey, Omaha. Hey, sing the fight song. That's what I mean. Yeah, sing the fight song. Hey. Bah, 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 Omaha. Bah. He didn't say Omaha at all. I cannot wait. This is great. I didn't say Omaha. I it's understand you didn't. Oh. But now you're saying it's Omaha. Oh, my God. The that fucking no the the audibles, the audibles that you call during your arguments are unbelievable, man. <laughs> you're like, oh, uh, hey, look over here. Woo-hoo-hoo. Hey, everybody just settle down. We're not playing Big O at our table. We're yeah. actually having a big, big O tournament. <laughs> At the Grand Poker Series. The Ricky Dick Lock. Tournament. June 24, 2019. That's great. That was recently. Plug your social media. 
The Grand Series. Is that what we're going to do? Is that on the list? We're plugging yeah. our social media? Plug that shit. Look, man, Bill, you brought up the poker, man. Talk about your rinky dink game. Now. <laughs> Texas Hold'em. Texas Hold'em. Straight Hold'em. Texas Hold'em. Let's go board. Let's go fucking look at each other. Look at two cards. and Oh, I'm going to bluff you. <laughs> Boring as hell. <laughs> <laughs> See how? Hey, guys, the, li- the wick is lit. Boring as hell. I'd rather <laughs> fucking paint the walls. <laughs> He rather <laughs> paint the walls. <laughs> he never painting the wall. <laughs> by, by, by the way, if you like Texas Hold'em so much, why don't you ever play? Man, because you know you need a bankroll. No, pretty much. Dude, no. He plays with the play play. We've been over this. Yeah, I play play. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the funny thing, Morvito told me on the plane. He goes, "I practice black." <laughs> <on my> <laughs> He says, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I practiced on my Hey, phone. you know, that's a funny thing because I was listening to that episode and they were talking no, about. No, he's talking about old Morbido, not young Morbido. But yeah. Oh, well, the young Morbido. He was like, yeah, man, they go to Vegas and you never win out there. You never win. I was like, whole time I was like, bullshit. <laughs> yeah. The seriously. first time they usually let you win and then all of a sudden you're going back five times to give a L, 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 L. You know what I mean? Every time you go, you're going to get a loss. But yeah. the first time they give you a W. Yeah. <laughs> so, at least so the first day, back, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, the thing is, I think people go out and they get pissed drunk, and that's not good. You know, you can never win like that. Yeah, but it's fun. But it's fun. <laughs> Listen, there's nothing better than free alcohol. That's true. You're like, hey, Patron, <laughs> what did I drink? Seven of those? That's seven dollars times seven. It's forty nine dollars. Red Bull vodka <laughs> and two shots to go. Yes. Yeah. I mean, dude, we used to get like just wash tubs of Crown Royal. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'd get like ginger ale on the side. I need two shots of Crown. And a pack of cigarettes. And a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and they were just like, click, 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 click. And all of a sudden, the waitress would come running over. Here you go. Whatever you Wait, need. Wait, what's the click, click, click? The, uh, the, the, I don't want to say pit boss. Um, the floor waitress. manager. Floor manager. Floor manager behind. You ask him, hey, is there any way? Because the cigarettes aren't given by the waitresses. Hey, is that what? Oh, wait. Yeah, and basically, you have to click. Click, 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 click. <laughs> Big O poker. Oh, it's a, Paul, it's a, it's a, it's a f- five card game. Low eight. Listen, everyone needs to it's not down Omaha. <laughs> hey. Oh, no, it's five. It's Omaha. No, they play two five big O at the win. So it's, a, right it's Omaha. Okay, it's continue. Omaha. What, I the, said it was Omaha. With the clicker, with the clicker. <laughs> March twenty first, two thousand nineteen. Big O at the win. They play drama on Vegas now too. No way. It's dealt a little really? different. It's dealt a little different. So the clicker is basically, you know, like I said, the floor manager and clicker. will come and <laughs> click, 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 click. It, it don't go like that. that. click will reach out to all the waitresses, and they'll come and they'll give you either, Dude, you, you know, the, the drink is so long. and or, you know, your cigarettes and so forth. But now, I don't think you get cigarettes anymore. I think we need. There ain't no clicker either. I think we know someone who would like a clicker. Yeah. You know, because you just go to those. I don't even know what hotels you go to. Hard Rock? I go to the hotels that are still hotels that consider themselves old school Vegas. Uh, yeah, you know I mean, they're gone. No, it ain't. Gold Coast is still there. That's the only one. No, Barbary no, Coast? You got a hook up there. Come on. Barbary Coast? Yeah, but still, they had the clicker. No, Barbary Coast is no more. It's Dre. Or, uh. Bally's? Dre's is there. It's on. Dre's is on the roof now. Yeah, but what's Barbary Coast? Barbary Coast is, uh. Con- not cause them the Orleans? No, it's like the hippest place. To no, be the in. Orleans is is the old school place. That might be gone too. The Orleans, Gold Coast, and Barbary Coast are owned by the same owner. Okay, so I don't know what they did with the Barbary Coast, but the they Barbary the, Coast was where Dre's was, right? They had the nightclub Dre's in there. Yeah, now it's on the roof and it's a pool up there. Okay, it's dope. Did I go? No. <laughs> <What's> the, <laughs> <laughs> I saw the pictures. <laughs> oh, it's called the Cromwell. Came into my head. The the hotel's called the Cromwell. The Cromwell, and it's deluxe. I mean, they got like. Oh, so they basically changed it. But yeah. I wonder if they just sold it and maybe sold it. I don't know. You took me to Dre's in the basement, and it was four in the morning when they opened. Remember? <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was crazy. I'll never forget that. Your boy, Dave Henderson. Yeah, he was out there. I said, I'll never forget. I got like six Red Bull vodkas. <clears throat> He's like, Coke. You sure you want to do that? Hey. I said, Why? <laughs> oh. <Uh-oh. laughs> he goes, Dude, that's. That's gonna be over a hundred. I said, "Get the f-. <laughs> like, yeah." You know I, mean? I was like, "What?" He's used to drinking yeah, the free ones upstairs. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was like, "Hey, man, I get it. yeah, seriously, Bloody Marys. They, they had the best Bloody Marys in the country at uh, Barbary Coast." But yeah, he used to drinking the free ones in the uh, in the casino. So you go there, and it's like that'll be one hundred thirty bucks. 
Hmm. She Jesus. Like, Ooh. Ooh. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like the vomit starts rolling up. You're like, all right, man, sh- sh- let me whip this off. Because <laughs> you know, you're in Vegas. Up. You just throw, you, you're in you Vegas, th- you throw right. 150 and you be like, go ahead, keep that. Keep that. And then all of a sudden, everybody. Because so, it's funny, because the locals look at you and they like, go, "Thanks, you cheap bastard." The locals <laughs> look at you like this. The locals look at you like, "Holy shit, dude! He just paid 150 for drinks." You know what I mean? Because they're not typically going to do that. No, they're free upstairs. But we, because we're tourists, tourists, we go there. We're not. You know, we're. It's like the guys that come down and spend money at Ohio State. Yeah. So I look at it like this. The reason why they're paying six dollars a drink, we're not, because we live here in Columbus. We be goddamn yeah, if we're, we're not. Do we're that. not here for the experience. They're going to come down once a year. and They're going to spend five, six, seven hundred dollars. They don't care. You yeah. know what I mean? And that's the reason why the prices are where they are. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because they're called game day prices. They're going to pay for that experience yeah. no matter what. And just so everyone knows, the little bar is the cheapest prices in town. So come on by. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Clown. <laughs> I'm not going to stand by that. No, I mean, <laughs> at you, all. you're going to pay a premium no matter where you go. You Varsity mean. Club's only $4 beers. Whoa, settle down. <clears throat> it okay. is. Well, if you're there, make you sure to use cash. get a 12-ounce beer or a 16-ounce beer? I don't, I don't know. Because that's the difference. Our, our 16? Ours are 16. Oh. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's, yeah. For $2 more? Yeah. Four ounces? Yeah. That's $2 an ounce. $2, two ounces. Oh, fucking mathematician. I know. <laughs> Would you rather pay four or six? Hey, we're not here to judge. I'm asking we're you all there an, an make, opinion. I'm not yeah. asking you to judge a clown. I personally liked it when it was four because they would give you a five dollar exactly tip, a dollar tip exactly. So what it does it helps out everybody right from that aspect. You're still making money right. You know what I mean? <laughs> Just like true. when they used to put you know we used to have five bartenders at that little bar where I work. No way. Now we have two. Really? Yeah. What so, year did you have five? The first couple of years when we rocked, well, the other bar wasn't there and the beer truck wasn't there. It was just another Red Bull bar over there. Uh, so it was like that was the main bar, mm. and we sold a ton of shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's when you used to rock it out, like eight, nine hundred. I remember, yeah, when Tommy was the uh, when Tommy was working the front door back in the day. Tommy before, who? Before that, even I didn't even know Tommy that then. Really? Mm-mm. Was it you think he was buddies with Dan? No, because two thousand six started. They, two, I mean, two thousand seven. Two thousand eight. The season the 2007, 2008 was when Adam put that big ass tent up for the LSU game. 2007, six, they started. Wasn't it? It. LSU was 2006. We 2008. lost. 2008. 2008 was the uh, yeah yeah, but uh. 2007 was the first season that they dude. Did that seems like that was like yesterday. Ten years, right? Twelve years. Jesus. I think we should do like the Little Bar Chronicles. You were eight. I know that was a while ago. Ten years. That's Wait, crazy. It had to be longer than that. Yeah, I don't know. 2006, I was five. Oh. <laughs> All right, folks, we're done. <laughs> J- Jamie just gave us the finger. He was like, yeah. let's go. No, we're, <laughs> he goes, we're done. Hey. Shut it down. I'm, I'm already sick of this already. <laughs> well, we're talking about Jesus yeah. Christ, man. He can't talk about it, anything. He'll put joint. his legs up, head back, count <laughs> his money. Me. That's you. <laughs> All right. Yo, did we have a meeting? We didn't have a meeting. What did you say your meeting was going to We're going to have a meeting after. Don't worry about it. So now, <laughs> Christ. All the information out here. Say, so, right. you got to give a shout out to anybody? Yeah, <sighs> shout out to uh, the Apple. Apple app. Give us a five-star rating. Dude, Consistent Apple genius. don't even work. Just go to YouTube. YouTube. Go to YouTube and, and, and click on Consistent Genius. Although, although people that are watching this, they probably already go to YouTube and, uh, and do it. At least, uh, you know, a bunch of people that I know. So Apple, you know, I guess doesn't work. That but, well. Why does it not work? It doesn't. Hey, did, it by works. the way, did it? I My dude it. has an Apple. And he tried to go to Apple iTunes and it didn't pull up. He Consistent G- No, you can't go on music. You have to go on Apple Podcasts. It's an actual app. We're on Spotify too. Subscribe on YouTube. Just, it, yeah, we're we're on the places. internet. You know, consistentgenius.com. It'll take you there. Peace.